This video is sponsored by Santa Cruz Software. We all, every one of you in this room, should be using styles more. Paragraph, character, object, table, cell styles, right? Admit it, all of us, okay? But the trouble is, setting up styles is time consuming and repetitive, right? And furthermore, we all tend to use the same styles over and over again. Now, they might look different, but we all do head one, head two, head three, body text, couple levels of numbering, a couple levels of bullets, hyperlink, yada, 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 yada. So you're doing the same thing over and over and over again, right? And when you do that over and over again, when you're defining a style, like a paragraph style, you really should be thinking about some things you're not really thinking about probably, like, you know, should I have hyphenation turned on? Should I do apply next style? What about the space before and after? Keep options, making sure the language is English or whatever language you're dealing with. You know, we forget some of that stuff, right? So a lot of people copy styles from document to document. The trouble with that is that often leads to this kind of mess where you end up with giant style <laughs> recipes that have, you know, a bunch of cruft in them, right? Uh -huh. So there is a better way to do this. And this is, <laughs> seriously, and this is very, very simple. This is like the simplest tip you're going to hear this afternoon. And that is to simply use Creative Cloud libraries. Mm. And mm. what I would suggest that you do is you have one library called something like basic styles, new document. And you load that sucker up with some paragraph character and object styles that you use all the time. So here's a new document and I can just go in here and select all the text and find body text and boom, it's done. And then I find head one and make that head one, and then, then this is head two. And now you're saying, yeah, but Keith, I don't always want to use Myriad Pro for everything, right? But that's not the point. The point is I've now got body text head one and head two in this document copied from my library into this document simply by clicking on it. And now I go and I can select, you know, a paragraph, change it to Adele and update the style and they all change and, you know, I've got based on it. It's all in there. And so that you don't have to do this, all that prep work yourself, I've got a, you can take my Creative Cloud library with my styles in it and use that as a starting point for your own. And I've kind of carefully been crafting this for a long time in my own use. So it's the way I like it, mm. which is the way you should like it too. Wow. <laughs> Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel. And for thousands more how-to articles and tutorials, visit our website, creativepro.com, and become a member today. Thanks for learning with us.